Hi friends! I am so happy to see you guys again. Today is Friday, which is a really special day because it usually means that it's the end of our week and we get to come up to the weekend. And on Fridays, I like to do special things to celebrate the week that I just had or that we just had at school. And my thinking was because it's Friday, that I would read to you guys a book that is some of my friends in our classroom's favorite book. We read it a whole bunch at the beginning of the year and I was able to get into our classroom for just a little bit of time and grab a bunch of our favorite books and made sure I grabbed this one. This book is about feeling scared or anxious, which we might be feeling right now because we're in a silly time where we're not going to school like we normally do. And I also thought that would be important to talk about as well while we read the book. So this book is Owl Babies. The author is Martin Waddell and the illustrator is Patrick Benson. This is an absolute favorite book in our classroom. I'm so excited to read it to you guys. All right, Owl Babies. You can see it has a rip on the page because we've read it so many times. It's a very well-loved book. Once there were three baby owls, Sarah, Percy, and Bill. They lived in a hole in the trunk of a tree with their owl mother. The hole had twigs and leaves and owl feathers in it. It was their house. One night they woke up and their owl mother was gone. Where's mommy? asked Sarah. Oh my goodness, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. The baby owls thought. All owls think a lot. I think she's gone hunting, said Sarah. To get us our food, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. But their owl mother didn't come. The baby owls came out of their house and they sat in the tree and waited. A big branch for Sarah, a small branch for Percy, and an old piece of ivy for Bill. She'll be back, said Sarah. Back soon, said Percy. <laughs> I want my mommy, said Bill. It was dark in the woods and they had to be brave for things moved all around them. She'll bring us mice and things that are nice, said Sarah. I suppose so, said Percy. <laughs> I want my mommy, said Bill. They sat and they thought, all owls think a lot. I think we should all sit on my branch, said Sarah. And they did, all three together. Suppose she's got lost, said Sarah. Or a fox got her, said Percy. I want my mommy, said Bill. And the baby owls closed their eyes and wished their owl mother would come. <sighs> Who's that? There she comes, their owl mother. And she came. Soft and silent, she swooped through the trees to Sarah and Percy and Bill. Mommy! They cried and they flapped and they danced and they bounced up and down on their branch. Bounce, 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 bounce. They were so excited. They were so scared. And then their mom came back and now they are so happy to see her and so excited. What's all the fuss? their owl mother asked. You knew I'd come back, the baby owls thought. All owls think a lot. I knew it, said Sarah, and I knew it, said Percy. I love my mommy, said Bill. The end. Thank you guys for listening to Owl Babies. It's absolutely one of our favorites, and I hope that 
listening to it made maybe some of my friends at Inspire smile, thinking about all the times we got to read it in our classroom together. Bye!